So they get fruity, baby. They look half done. Done or not done. It is of no importance. A bhikkhu does not defile his body through cyber modification. It is against the Platimoksha. And yet, they knew about this. For me, there is no return. Hold on. Somebody forced you. Not just me. My brother, too. They drugged us. Desecrated my body. And all the while, they mocked me. How can you do this to a fellow human being and still mock them? How about your brother? He's still with him? Yes. I was first. Then, they were trying to decide how... how to modify him. You look like someone who can reason with these people. I beg you, please. Help my brother. I only hope it is not too late. I do not wish for him to end up like... like I have. What's in it for me? I don't work for free, you know. I cannot offer anything more than my gratitude. Just this once, please. Make an exception. The universe shall compensate you. Fine. I'll help. But just so you know, things might get ugly. Maelstrom doesn't mess around. There must be some other way. Help us, please. But without any bloodshed, I beg you. I'll see what I can do. Either way, your brother's getting out. I do not know how to thank you. They're keeping him in a shop just north of here. You shall find it next to the road along the docks. Thank <laughs> you. 
not do this. The implantation is against my beliefs. Please, I do not want them. Calm down. It's over now. I'm not with them. So... What are you doing here? What happened? I was walking by, caught some lame jokes about metal monks. Think about Maelstrom. They're never just joking. Nah. The truth, your brother sent me. He didn't want the same thing to happen to you. Thank you for coming to my rescue. But my life is not worth the deaths of others. One good deed does not justify the suffering you have sown. You have committed evil in its purest form. Hm. I liked your brother more. Your brother's waiting for you. Not far from here. First I must catch my breath. And then I shall go. It is him who shall need saving now. 